Yo, what is going on YouTube? It is your boy, Two Point Cho, and we are coming back with a brand new Pokemon Sword video. I heard about this trainer, and I decided to fight her. She has a super cool team. As you can tell from her starter, should be super interesting. Anyways, guys, let's cue that intro. Did um So anyways, we're back, and she has the starting trio. Super cool, I didn't know what order she was going to start them, and I didn't know that they were going to be this low of level. But, I think it's either the amount of times that you fight her, or the badges that you have that determine um, if they evolve, and all of that. Because we only have one badge, so she's not going to have super crazy... Um, high level mons. So, you know, still, it's super cool. She has all three of the starters. And it's one way to kind of fill out your Pokedex, at least by looking at it. Um, if you don't have internet, then you obviously can't connect with other people and trade. So, it's one way to do it, if you guys were wondering. Um, this is how. But also, I just, I don't know, I feel like because your rival, he has the Pokemon that's weak to yours. Um, so there's got to be someone else, because Leon has the final form. But again, I don't know, I haven't really played it, I don't know. And even if I did, I normally skip a lot of trainers. Which, I will work on that, but... You know, we'll see. We'll see when the time comes. Um, still, hope you guys are having a fantastic week. I am still on break, so I am trying to pump out as many videos as I can. Hope you guys are enjoying that, by the way. If you are, um, subscribe and share the video to a friend. I know, you know, we're in the middle of a playthrough, but we're still super early. They can catch up. But, again... Thank you guys for just checking it out. The team is probably going to get reworked here in the next few episodes. Um, I don't know, you know, when I could find some mons that I want for the full team. But we'll figure that out as we go. We beat her. She was super easy, but again, got some money. Got a little XP, but more importantly, just kind of seeing all of the Pokemon is neat. So anyways, that's that. Um, let's get right into the episode. We'll check out what this dude is having to sell. And then we'll just start progressing through the routes. Hopefully making it um, to the next big storyline event, if you know, we can do that. And maybe evolving someone in the meantime. But, anyways, that was that. I don't really want to catch these random guys. Stuffles, I don't need him. And then the dude chasing me wasn't even from this generation. So, no big deal. Let's get right into it. Go to Route 5. Because apparently that's where we have to go next. So, let's do it. Let's make our way over there. We're kind of far. Um, but, you know, should be fun. We sh should make it close this episode. Um, I hope that this episode isn't too long. We'll try not to, to go for that. But, again, we'll get some, some gameplay going, some decent content we'll go till we reach something cool and then we'll call it good my pokemon weren't damaged that much i don't know why i healed but uh anyways i am really loving this game um if you guys are playing it you guys have probably already passed me but still go back and replay this game if you've already beaten it make another account the switch is really cool about that 
um, where you can just have multiple accounts and basically replay it without deleting your save file. I don't know how many accounts it can have, but there's two accounts on the Switch that I'm playing on. Um, basically just to like test a few things out, play as much as I want. Um, but again, for stuff like this, this is my first time seeing it. But if I wanted to, I could load up another save file and play it again, or, you know, just play it as far as I can. But again, you know, that's for whenever I beat the game. And I, I want to replay it, but I don't want to delete the save file. Anyways, guys, um, I feel like we've already been through here. Is there any way... Can we just fly over here? So we could fly to that one. Um, yeah, let's do it. Might as well. Save us some time. I didn't really... Oh, this is Turfield. Okay. I love the music here. It's kind of just nice and groovy. A little background guitar. Super quiet. Ar already made it to Route 5. Ooh, what is going on here? Is this a double battle? Good Pokemon and trainers really shine on camera. Please tell me this is a double. I'm challenged by interviewers Gillian and Cam. Let's see. Nice. It is. Um, that dude is electric. So, really want to get rid of him first. And then Snarl hits both, which is perfect. Clink, clink. Or clink. Wow, that, oh, okay, I was like, that did a lot. Clink could probably have an electric move too, but I know Helioptile is electric. Perfect, there we go. Taking him out. It's probably the most important. Decent XP. Charge beam. Yeah, well, I figured. That's a weak one, though. Yeah, that, that didn't do much. Critical, even. Alright, not too shabby. But, uh, Thievil. Mm, eh, no, Thievil can't. Um, I guess, you know, he's... Because that lowered it, so... Is that another crit? Good lord. Alright, I mean, that was a decent damage. And then he grew, so he deserved it. There we go. I, I just love double battles. They're, they're a lot more fun. And I kind of wish that um, they would throw more into the game. Anyways, what is down here? I like how they gave us an option to go up or down. Three heal balls. Not bad. I guess I'll take anything at this point. Can we catch a, a cool mon here? That's what, what about to go down? Can we avoid every trainer possible as well? Who knows? Find out in this episode. There was something here. Um, I think it was the little apple guy, actually. He might be here. I really hope so. I just remember something cool being here. But, uh, yeah, we'll find out. We will find out. We'll give it a few attempts. If we don't find what we want, then we'll just run. Do it off camera if need be. Um, yeah, so... I'll, I'll do one more and then I'll cut it um, to where we need to be. Cool. Just checking. Figured as much. Two big mushrooms. Alright, anyways. We'll, we'll do one more attempt and then we'll cut it. I guess this counts as an attempt. So, uh, we'll be right back. So I tried, I don't know, 15 attempts. Couldn't find him. I don't know if he's in there. Um, but... The website that I looked on said he was on this route. So maybe that's something I'll have to come back to. 
and uh, figure that out. But, anyways, I just started, ah, God, I can't speak. I started walking, um, just leaving the route, and this lady challenged me. So, anyways, as you can see, our team didn't change. Um, you guys didn't miss anything besides maybe 10 minutes or so of me trying to find an Applin. So, who knows? Who knows? Ooh, Zigzagoon picked up a potion. I don't even know what this thing is. I think it's... I think it's grass. What's... Let's see. It's probably fairy and something, for sure. Lowered attack, alright. No biggie. Actually, that might be physical. So, he's probably grass and something else. Alright. Oh wow, that gave quite a bit of XP. Tranquil, Squirt, Rookity, and Sizzlepeed all grew. There we go. I wasn't sure which moves were, were, were moves. Yeah. Ooh, nice. Nice. Rookity. Um, so I actually, I went back and I caught a few of these, um, because I, at first I just thought that he was one of those annoying bird Pokemon, but turns out he evolves into Corviknight at the end, which I didn't know. Um, but I figured the game has been out long enough that I, you know, if I want to, I can spoil it for myself. And, uh, I just really wanted one. So, you know, I'm pretty excited for him. I know that he's really strong, um, depending on what moves you give him. Wow, we just totally avoided that guy. Neat. But, yeah, so, um, I forgot to mention that earlier, but that's why. And, again, the day... That we get a Corviknight, I'm going to be super, super pleased. Ooh, looks like the next big plot. We're going to use that bike. You don't even have a Rotom with you. Hey, young gym challenger. Please, if you could, give them a thrashing. And then these guys are like screaming at me. Oi, we're not trying to steal the bike. And it's like, bro, please relax. I wonder, like, if Team Yell just always yells, and that's where they got their nickname from, or if they just thought that it looked or sounded cool, you know? Because, like, I could see it. The way that they designed it, it looks cool. I mean, kinda. It looks better than some, but it definitely looks worse than, like, Team Galactic looked really cool. And then you got these guys right next to them, and they just... They don't look well. I, I don't know. They could have done a little bit better. I think. Just the design was. Um, let's see. Let's see our new evolved guy. Dang. Plus one, he's not too bad. Zigzagoon. Leveling up. I think he evolves early 20s. Not too sure. Thievil. Ooh, here we go. We're already at plus one. We might as well stay in. I feel like that's kind of early to have an evolved guy. I mean, we have a few, but still. Snarl. I think it's funny. This dude's special attack is better than his attack. Um, at least my Thievil is. But he seems like he shouldn't be that way. Still, Snarl is a pretty strong move early on. And wow, he gave quite a bit of XP. Alright, that was easy. Do we have to fight the next one, or are they just going to leave in a pair? Find out. Now. Why? I want that bike. Alright, I guess we gotta fight them both. No big deal. No big deal. I wanted some action this episode. 
Sableye, that is a really cool Pokemon. He was one of my favorites, and it was depressing because I got the, the copy, like, Ruby, um, where I couldn't even get him. Like, I was stuck with Mawile, and it was, it was really sad, honestly. Like, I totally get, you know, splitting up the Pokemon so where you can't get them all so that you have to buy both games. But it can be kind of frustrating from time to time. For some reason, I expected that to do more. But he did nothing, so not too worried. I don't know if that'll actually kill the next time. If we get a high roll, maybe. If the last two were low... Nah, nah, that's fair. I mean, Scratch, he, he ended up doing more for only using Scratch on me. But maybe going for Pluck would have been the play. I don't know. I don't really know. But we won, and that's all that matters. And again, got decent XP. Thievo's level 20, Sizzlepeed 17, slowly leveling up. Oh man, I was distracted by the bike. Of course you were. Always looking for excuses. Never be that guy. Never be that guy, kids. Always own up to your mistakes. Alright, that's that. My word, you are quite the trainer. And you have a Pokedex, too. That means you have a Rotom. Fantastic. I think I have just the gift for you. Anyways, let me give you uh, a bike. Come on now, give it a shot. Enjoy cycling together with Rotom. Chop chop. You and Rotom better ride. Rotom bike. You can combine the bike. Press the plus or minus button to ride the bike. Let's get cycling. Alright. Bike moves kind of fast, kind of hard to turn. I like it though. I mean, gets me around faster. Um, looks like Team Yell does yell. Nice to know. Nice to know. And Zigzagoon has another item. Alright. Cool with me. Let's see. What is there to do next? Oh, hop. Please, don't fight me just yet. I'm warning you, any closer and we're going to have to battle. You and me. Perfect. Perfect. Something tells me you're supposed to get on the bike and just kind of charge forward. But, need to heal up Corviknight. And, uh, I don't know, Hop, usually he hasn't been too strong so far. Then again, we've only fought him seven times. Woo-loo. Alright, he, he only has three mons. Alright. Tranquil. Still, I think, is our highest level. Anyways, after this, we're going to call it. So, decent time. Um, I am starting to work on Pokemon Eevee. I know that I just finished it, but in reality, I finished it about two weeks earlier than I got to post the final video. Um, so, you know, now it's just a decent time, and by the time you you know, watch this. I'll probably still have a few weeks, but I am working on creating one last video of just challenging Red, maybe catching Mewtwo in the process. Um, I don't know. What do you guys think about that? Would you want me to waste my time? Because I've already started on it. So if anyone comments, please comment yes. Um, but again, I just think that it would be something cool to do for you guys and just kind of like a little cool little video checking it out that way you know I don't have to spam you with this or idle heroes which again I can totally do but your call if you guys have any recommendations at all let me know down below that would be greatly appreciated let's get right back into this fight with hop I didn't even read who he's sending out um, Corvus Squire is probably good enough. Let's see. 
Who is it? Oh, his own... Wow, his own Corvus Squire. Perfect, I guess. We'll see which one's stronger. We're both level 19. Good thing I healed up. Kind of want to go Hone Claws. Um, but... Alright. I was thinking... At this rate, I don't know if it's worth it. Fury attack might be too... Leer. Alright. Good. Good. If you went for Leer first turn, um, then it'd probably be different. Whoa. Fury attack? Nah, it's too risky, man. I was thinking of doing that myself. Yeah, I doubt that's like a waste of your turn right there. Oh wow, we three. Three shot him. Not bad, I was expecting four. I expected him just to barely live. Dang. They just throw XP at you in this game. Tranquil's level 23. I can like hear Corvus Squire just flap his wings. And it's like really loud. At first I thought it was the mic pickup. Um, this one is going to be his like fire guy. But I kind of want... Zigzagoon to get some XP just because he's like he never fights so he doesn't get a whole lot of XP Every one of my Pokemon is an ace. This is no problem at all. I Hope so man. I hope so All right, let's you know use one or two moves. Oh double. Oh wow. I forgot We're dead. We're dead. Oh, I Forgot about that actually um, I guess he's getting no XP. Whatever. I learned loads from studying Lee's battles. No big deal. Again, we don't use him anyways. He's not really important. Um, and I knew that he was the fire dude. I forgot that he was probably going to have... Why couldn't you use that last turn? Attack fell as if we're going to use pound on you. Ooh, barely lived. Typical. Should have known you've mastered the type matchups. Anyways, boys, that is it. I'm gonna use Swift, 100% KO. Um, so that about wraps up the video. Again, if you guys made it this far, make sure to subscribe. You've already enjoyed 25 minutes of me talking. Might as well enjoy more. Also, like the video. Comment down again. Let me know if there's anything you'd like to see. And also, one last thing, if you guys could share this video, it would be awesome and it would mean a lot to me. Just kind of tell me that you guys enjoy it and that you think someone else would. So, anyways, let me know. And again, I appreciate it. More Sword and Shield coming soon, maybe more Dragon Ball, who knows. Definitely Idol Heroes. So stick tuned. Anyways guys, this is Two Point Show. Signing out. Hope you guys have a blessed day and take care. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.